Hi, this is Asen. Today, I would like to share how to show password characters on Thanksbox. First, we go to Developer tab, then we click on Visual Basic. After that, we click on Insert User Form. Okay, this is the user form that I designed. If let's say we want to change the name, we can click on the Properties window. Okay, then we change under Caption. Okay, then we can insert a text box to allow the user to key in the password. Okay, for this text box, we can change the font and the font size over here. Okay, after that, we look for password character. Okay, then we type up asterisk here. Okay, okay, then after that, we can create two command buttons. Okay, one to check whether the password is correct want to cancel this user form okay we can also insert a chat box to allow the user to decide whether to show the password okay we can double click to write the code if let's say the user check the chat box means that the value is true then we have to discard the asterisk so means that we have to remove the asterisk leave make it be empty Okay, if let's say the user uncheck the check box, then we have to turn the password character back to a string. Okay, after that, if let's say the user click, click on OK, means that after entering the password and click on OK, then we have to check whether the user entered a correct password or not. If let's say the user enter a correct password, then we have to close the user form and then prompt out a message, for example, like welcome. Okay, if let's say the user enter a wrong password, okay, we can first close the user form, then prompt out a message that tell the user that the password is incorrect. After that, ask the user to re-enter the password. So we have to prompt out the user form again. Okay, if let's say the user don't want to key in the password and click on cancel, then we can straight away unload the user form. Okay, if let's say I want this user form to prompt out immediately when I open the Excel file, we can go to this workbook. Okay, the object here, make sure this workbook and the procedure is open. Okay, then we type user form one dot show because the name of the user form is user form one. Okay, now we check our result. Okay, I close everything. Okay, open. So the text box will prompt up immediately. If let's say I enter a password, okay, as you can see, okay, we'll have a password character. If let's say I click on show password, okay, it will show me the password. Okay, if let's say I uncheck, okay, it will back to the asterisk. Okay, if let's say I enter a wrong password, okay, the password that I set is one two three. If let's say I Press for 4, 5, 6, and then I click on OK. So the Excel will tell me that invalid password and ask me to try again. Okay, then I have to key in one more time. If let's say I key in the correct password, 1, 2, 3, then it will tell me welcome. Okay, okay that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.